She is known for her appearances in popular television shows such as Hawaii Five-0, Emergency, and Chips. She is recognized for her roles in films like High Noon, Part 2, The Return of Will Kane and the sci-fi thriller The Hidden. Her name is Catherine Cannon. In the world of television and film, one actor has left an indelible mark on the industry, Catherine Cannon. Born with a passion for performing, Cannon's early roles showcased her talent and versatility. From appearing in popular shows like Hawaii Five-0 and Emergency, to starring in movies like Fool's Parade and Women in Chains, she quickly made a name for herself. But it was her role as Amy Kane in High Noon, Part 2, The Return of Will Kane that truly put her in the spotlight. Portraying the strong-willed character with grace and conviction, Cannon captivated audiences and earned critical acclaim. This breakthrough role opened doors for her, leading to recurring roles on shows like Barnaby Jones and Chips, where she played the fearless female trucker Robbie Davis. However, it was her portrayal of Felice Martin on the iconic teen series Beverly Hills, 90210 that solidified Cannon's place in television history. As the cheating and domineering mother of Donna Martin, she brought a complexity and depth to the character that resonated with viewers. Her performance on the show remains one of her most memorable and beloved roles. Throughout her career, Catherine Cannon has proven herself as a talented and versatile actor. From her early beginnings to her impactful roles, she has left a lasting legacy in the entertainment industry. Her dedication to her craft and ability to bring characters to life have made her a beloved figure in television and film. Catherine Cannon's impact on the industry will continue to be felt for years to come. Catherine Cannon, born on September 6, 1953 in Hartford, Connecticut, had a personal life that people were quite intrigued by. Growing up in Laguna Beach, California, she was exposed to the world of acting at a young age, thanks to Judy Farrell, the wife of actor Mike Farrell. In 1974, Cannon tied the knot with Richard Chambers, a commercial director. The couple welcomed a son named Colin Thomas Chambers into the world. However, their marriage eventually came to an end, and they divorced in 1980. It was a challenging time for Cannon, but she remained determined to pursue her acting career. Years later, in 2001, Cannon found love once again when she married actor Dean Butler. It was actually during an audition for the popular series, Father Murphy, where Cannon auditioned for the female lead, that she crossed paths with Butler, who played Almanzo Wilder on the beloved show, Little House on the Prairie. Their connection was undeniable, and they decided to take their relationship to the next level. Throughout her personal journey, Cannon remained focused on her passion for acting. She had a natural talent and a captivating presence on screen that drew people in. Her dedication and perseverance paid off as she continued to land roles in various television shows and movies. Do you want to explore more actors? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.